Hey guys, Sponge Murphy here. Uh, my last one of my last videos was I was painting some Tau Fire Warriors, and um, and literally I'm taking a break from it because literally everything I try to paint on these guys is not going as planned. And um, just paint work ain't coming out in there as nice, so I'm just leaving it on the back boiler for a while. And then when I did the how many points my Skaven army has, I do have a good few. I think about ten, maybe more. I can't remember. Um. Actually, it could be more closer to 15 now that I think of it. I have a lot of storm vermin to do. Um, and the ones I did were like, they were nice, they were good, they came out well. But I think I'm just going to try and do some of these up for the Skaven zombies. Um, so I have two here. And I'm just going to kind of paint these guys up first because I'm going to try and convert some of the rest of them up. Well, not convert, but you know, try something different with them. Instead of just giving them like a, a paint job to make them look zombie-ish. And try and take it to the next level, that kind of way. So, um, so I just started with two guys. Um, basically, and I know with the other guy I had like cream. Their other cloth was kind of cream. With um, red armor. So I was kind of going the basic armor with these guys. Like silver armor and then just the red cloth on them. Um, I went with like the zombie kind of flesh color. Which is rotten flesh. Um... I'm trying to think. Yeah, everything. These are just all kind of the base coats on it, with um, a wash over them. And basically, let's have a quick look at this guy. I'll just get the base coats done and then kind of work on it from that. What I'm planning on trying to do is the weapon he has here, the halberd. I think about putting like a strong, make it look like a magic weapon, like a really strong kind of bright highlight on it. Um. Because they are meant to be like risen from the dead, so they want to have like, I think what was it called? I think uh, this grey here with uh, green eyes. So I have like the green glow from these guys' eyes, and then like the green going along here. Um, and then the armor. I'm going to make the armor really rusty looking. The claw is going to look kind of dirty. Um, yeah, just basically look like like the real corpses, but like they don't have like shiny weapons or anything. They're well used, that kind of way. Um. I still I haven't even took like the heads or the other arms for this guy. I don't even know what's going to be on this guy yet. So um, I do have some like kind of basic ideas for like changing the weapons around, like like cut off his arm and replace it with a blade. You know, as if he doesn't have an arm, so just like stuck a blade in there instead. That type of thing. And then try and do at least a decent amount of work on the bases. I have to come up with a team for that. I was thinking about doing. I think maybe. It's kind of like a graveyard, a dirt road type of thing. So it's going with grass or just sand on it. So um, yeah, so that's what I'm basically up to now, trying to get these done. Um, I don't know how long the towel's going to be on the back boiler, even looking at them now. I don't even want to go near them for a long time. Um, and then I don't want to start too much stuff, because once the Christmas period kicks in, you know, everyone's going to be really busy, you, won't, you might not get a whole lot done. So I think I have one big model that I want to try and get done before Christmas, or at least start. And then just like, so I'm going to do in the new year then. So um, yeah, so basically I'm wanting you guys to show or to like think of any ideas to help me with this. What kind of little conversions I can add to them to make them stick out. Like I'm going to give these guys like the bloody mouths. And um, you know, make them look kind of wild and wicked that kind of way. Like they're hungry for flesh. Cut their arms with it, give them the scars and all that type of stuff. So um, so um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. Leave a comment below. Uh, make sure to hit the like button. Like button, like button, like like button. Ugh. I can't even say it now. Like button, and um, subscribe if you haven't. So um, thanks for watching, and I, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have an update on these pretty quick. I want to get these guys kind of done by Friday. And um, I have to pick out the weapons for this guy and then get two heads. So um, thanks for watching, and I look forward to seeing your guys' opinions. And uh, see you guys next time.